You know, it's uh, humbling to be here with all these champions and friends and teammates, competitors. Uh, Joe, before I go any further, I know it's been said, every time I see you on pit road before the race, I tell you we're praying for JD, and I want you to know that's true tonight. Everyone said that, but uh, God be with you and your family. And uh, what an amazing final four we had with uh, Carl and Kyle and Joe, your whole uh, organization, what a heck of a year. And to my hero, Roger Penske, uh, what an awesome, uh, the Bill France Award. I don't know anyone deserves it any better. And, um, and Joey, what a heck of a race there. Where's Joey? He's not there either. Um, that big grin, I don't know what it'd be like looking at that in the mirror. That would that'd be awful tough, but um, um, I tell him, I hate you on restarts, man. Anyway, but, uh, but I'm, I'm so honored to be here tonight. What, again, what a, what a year it's been. Um, I just can't tell you how proud I am of uh, just this whole incredible season. Um, you know, to go ahead, <laughs> I got off script. The competition in our sports never been any better. I want to congratulate every person at Hendrick Motorsports here and back home. You know, we've uh, pulled together to win our 12th championship, the engine builder of the year, crew chief of the year, and it was truly a team effort. I'm so proud of everyone and what you've accomplished together. You know, thank our drivers, the crew chiefs. Chase, what about rookie of the year? I can't wait to see what the future holds for you, young man. And Casey, what a strong finish. And it's so fun just watching you become a dad. And Alex Bowman stepped in this year and what a great job you did. And to Dale, congratulations to you, buddy, on uh, another most popular driver. And I know everybody's excited. I can't wait to see you back at Daytona. And to a co-owner of the 48 team, Jeff Gordon, man, I'm sorry for interrupting your vacation and bringing you back out of retirement. Buddy, you are the ultimate team player. Not only this year, but every year you've been there for me. So a big thanks to you for telling me to hire Jimmy after Michigan. Jimmy, before I do anything else, I want to thank you for remembering our son. You know, I wouldn't be here tonight. We wouldn't be here tonight with you if it wasn't for Ricky. You were the first person that said, he was the first person that said, Dad, I'm telling you, Jimmy's going to be a superstar. So I'm grateful for him for bringing you into our life, not because of just the seven championships, because you are a champion person. I know Ricky's looking down on us tonight. We'll always remember our family and friends who are no longer with us, including Betty Jane France, that meant so much to NASCAR, to me and my family. You know, Jimmy had this idea in the off season, we'd go to Florida for a little team building with the drivers and crew chiefs. Now fast forward to the summer and we're struggling. We lose Dale. It was a test of our character. And that's when Jimmy stepped up and that's when his leadership really shined. Bringing everyone together, January paid off when the chips were down in July. Instead of retreating, we got closer and we even more committed. So Jimmy just doesn't show up and drive the car. He sets the tone, the leadership, the competitive fire, the love and appreciation of family and people. You're a champion in every sense of the word. And then when you join the ranks of Richard Petty, Dale Earnhardt, the greatest to ever race, and you're not done yet. Congratulations, buddy, on seven. And Chad, you are what you're, yeah, please give him a hand. And Chad, you are what your record says you are. You're the best crew chief in NASCAR history. And not only that, I'll put you up against any coach in the sport except Gibbs. Your, your work ethic and your leadership is second to none. Congratulations to you and the entire 48 team. I'm so proud of you. To Robert Neblock and all of the 285,000 Lowe's associates, one driver, one sponsor, one team. Lowe's took a chance on us, and you've been there ever since. Your partnership not only makes this possible, it makes us successful. Congratulations, Robert, on your seventh title. 
You know, we have incredible corporate partners at Hendrick Motorsports. Our longtime sponsors like Mountain Dew, Exalta, and Vaveline. Our friends at Great Clips and Napa Auto Parts and Nationwide. And great folks at AARP and 3M Kelly Blue Book. LiftMaster and Farmers Insurance. Freightliner, Panasonic, Quicken Loans, Sun Energy One, Tax Slayer, and Unifirst. And we have a lot of technical partners like Bosch, Microsoft, Siemens, Wix, and we want to especially thank Gene Haas and Haas Automation. We're going to miss those guys. And to Mark Royce and Jim Campbell and all our partners at Chevrolet, I just celebrated my 40th year as a Chevrolet dealer. And I've never raced anything but a Chevrolet. And congratulations on another championship to you guys. and to my family, Linda, and I've been married for 44 years. And she's been putting up for racing for 44 years. And, uh, and she's been there through everything. And I gotta tell you a story, in January, uh, 44 years ago, we were standing in a grocery store and getting ready to go to a drag race. And we had to count our money before we got to the register because I didn't know if we had enough to pay for what we had in the basket. But she supported me to go drag race anyway. So, honey, thank you. I love you. And uh, you've been there. I'm so proud of our daughter, Lynn Marshall, and our three amazing grandkids. God has truly blessed us. I want to thank the France family and everyone at the Na and the NASCAR team. We've had tremendous collaboration this year. And everyone at Sprints who helped elevate our sport, we're so grateful to you. It's a Sunoco and Firestone. It's Firestone, golly, good year, good year. You gave us the gold car, I'm sorry. Uh, congratulations to uh, Bob Carter, Toyota from the Manufacturers Championship, and to Daniel Suarez, Johnny Sauter, and the NASCAR, all the NASCAR champions. And the NASCAR fans, you're the best in the sport. Thank you for supporting us. And to Tony Stewart, we're gonna miss you, buddy. And I think what you saw tonight all of motorsport loves you. Congratulations on an incredible champion, an incredible career, and what a big heart. Your friendship means so much to me. And to my brother, Felix Sabatas, I can't wait to see you back at the track. Get well, man. So congratulations again to Jimmy and Channy, Chad and Brooke, Robert and Melanie, Lowe's and the whole 48 team for making history. You know, I'm proud to be part of a sport that prays before we race, puts our hand over our heart, and pays honor to our country and our men in uniform. And that's what our NASCAR community is all about. So, thank you, thank you, thank you. So good night. God bless our country. Merry Christmas. Happy holidays to everyone.